welcome this is the energy vibration reading for um, the Aquarian Sun Moon and Rising for um, the month of uh, February um, 2018 I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for your wonderful support likes and shares and I want to say to each and every person I'm hoping and I'm wishing that um, your dreams will come true in this month whatever you have wished and asked for because the energy that is in this month it is uh, sort of a um, um, you know wonderful energies for you guys go and listen to the um, general readings because there are more information there for you okay so let's go forward and let's go and look at certain situations certain aspect what is going on around you okay um I want to say to each and every person this month has four weeks the month is a fire month the month has the energy of the wheel of fortune and um, um, the um, crowning energy of um, the energy of the chariot okay so you have the energy of judgment and the energy of judgment is a month where things are going to be opening up you are going to be receiving information that you weren't aware of there are things that is going to be happening um, that you weren't aware of and this is wonderful and this is good okay so this is positive so let's look at the four weeks and as we go along we're going to bow things so let's look at the four weeks as what is happening um, for you guys in the four weeks um, it's going to be the first week um, new beginnings well, then you have uh, um, you protected and then you have uh, the energy of uh, the moon uh, the energy of the seven of cups and then you have uh, the energy of the two of coins okay so um what is happening here it is a strange event that that's happening basically um, because there's a new beginning there's this judgment and this judgment brings a new beginning for you guys and the mother the mother of ones um, a lot of people are going to have um, new beginnings with the energy of your parents um, it doesn't have to be your parents but it has um, to be these new beginnings that are coming in is especially for um, people over the age of 40 and these are wonderful because um, it's as if you're being rebirthed in this time because you also have um, the energy of um, the nine of ones which is protection and then you have the energy of the seven of cups which is another sort of a protection in a way the energy of the moon the psychic so the spirit world is opening up and as you look at this it is a sort of a positive judgment that is coming in um, it is um, positive in the way that there are certain things that was not clear is coming back a certain information that you weren't aware of is coming up and and then you have the energy of the two of pentacles and the two of um, pentacle which is the earth energy so in the first week you have a once energy which you had the tower so whatever that was there there's a new beginning is coming up because you had the energy of the tower in the first week which is the general energies is the energy of the tower in the first week for you guys and then 
in the second week you have the star which you're protected by the spirit guides which is here which is a very good because the nine of ones is a protected um, thing and it's as if the spirit guides are protecting you guys and then you had the energy of the moon which the moon comes back as the seven of cups so the energy of the moon is a wonderful energy because what that is actually doing it is opening up your intuition and the seven of cups is giving you ideas and uh, um, positive things to do and, and and to work on and then we have um, a hurt energy and the last week uh, was the energy of the sun and the, and the earth energy the energy of the sun coming out with the energy of the two of pentacles this is wonderful so it is actually um, a lot of um, things or being cleared away so that new positive things can come in which is uh, extremely good and extremely positive so I'm really 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 liking um, your month so far because you're working with wonderful energies it's your birthday month so um, look out for your birthday readings okay so um, let's see what is because um, there's a new beginning that is coming in and this is mostly for the people over 40 and whatever it is you know that is going to um, stand up to you, you 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 are ready for this okay and these new beginnings and these um, seven of cups energy which is new ideas uh, um, new creative endeavors um, information that you'll be receiving and um, then you have the energy with the, the Sun over uh, the two so this is going to be wonderful it doesn't really matter what is really transpiring it is going to be good as we look at the um, connection between week one and week two we have the energy of the eight of Pentacles which is wonderful because um, the energy of the eight of Pentacles is always a time where you're working very hard and a lot of people um, in the general readings the eight of Pentacles also comes up within with the first week and the second week of February which is just so wonderful and it's so good because the transformation that is happening is um, especially for the people over the age of 40 is that you be working um, very hard if even it's um, for yourself or you're working in a company or you're trying to make things um, happen for you this is going to be extremely wonderful so um, it is um, you have the same energy as the general energy so um, this is actually good for you guys so, so as we look forward we're looking at the energy of um, the nine of wands with the seven of cups so you're having you're moving out of a fire week in um, a water week you're moving out of a fire week into a water week and you have the energy of a strength but this energy of strength is wonderful because it's as if um, the universal guides and angels are going to be bringing forward something wonderful because there is the lion with the infinity symbol and a roses so it's as if they're they're saying this is the last rope so um, just have strength because we are here and at the end of this inner strength this roses will be for you and infinity abundance and wisdom will come to you so this is absolutely wonderful this is the most beautiful lion ever um, because he is coming up to give you that inner strength and that last push before you come through all of what has been thrown at you for the last time okay so as we look at and you know the, these two months have just four weeks and um, it is so wonderful as we look at the third week going into um, as we look into the third week going into the fourth week we have the energy of the daughter of ones the energy of the daughter of ones and with this energy of the daughter of ones some of you have to deal with someone between the ages of 25 and 45 in the end of the third week uh, moving into the fourth week somebody have to deal with the energy of the daughter of um, 
wands the daughter of wands and the energy of the daughter of wands it's a very positive energy because what is happening is that for some people you'll be um, um, you know coming up with good ideas and good situation how you can help um, maybe a child in your life or a child that has um, has something to do with you and um, it's going to be wonderful because um, you have um, the seven of ones um, coming up um, with um, and this is such a beautiful card um, this is wonderful I'm, I'm, I'm so blown away because I love using these cards because they're so hurtly they're so um, you know going back to nature and um, this is one of my you know one of my most favorite decks um, to use especially for the um, monthly readings and this seven of ones is a wonderful positive energy because what this is doing is that it is connecting you you're standing up for yourself and you know whatever is happening you're standing up for yourself and you're saying you know um, there is some um, you know lines that I don't go over there are some things that I um, I don't accept there are some things that is very disrespectful and there are some things I will not um, go along with and I don't want people to drag me along with certain things um, in, in in life and this is where you're standing up for yourself because the seven of ones is always you're standing up and protecting yourself and you're saying to air and no further and this is very good because you are hard at work trying to um, bring forth um, something good in your life and then you you know you're you're standing up and you're saying no um, you know I am not going to accept certain things and um, this is where it stops you know this is this is it you know I don't need people to be on my case I don't need um, to be connected to a certain people and you know I'm so happy um, with these new smartphones there is something named block a person sometimes you will realize that certain um, relationship has ended and the best thing to do is to block people but what I've realized is that even if you block people they try some way with their ego ego base energy to you know sort of um, connect with you even when you say no I don't want um, you know any connection because obviously if you block someone that means you don't want to deal with the person anymore so here you have another one's energy and you have the five of ones and this is wonderful because a lot of information a lot of things will be coming at you and these are a really really good um, positive things um, because um, you have stand up for um, whatever injustice and equality and you have said no I will not or whatever disrespectfulness that people um, bring forth and you're saying no this is it this is where it stopped and it's not going any further which is a positive positive thing to do because you let people know how far and you have a, a draw a line and say till here and not further your last and final card you have the energy of the Sun of Wands the energy of the Sun of Wands so a lot of you a lot of you a lot of you mm -hmm. um, a lot of you will be um, basically um, working um, with a lot of fire sign people a lot of you will be basically working with a lot of fire sign people a lot of you will be actually um, it's, it's, it's you know really focusing on these energies and these are going to be good because um, some of you are going to have or feel the energy of a loss a broken heart um, that sort of a thing a loss or a broken heart and it's you know and um, whenever this comes up especially um, since the energies are changing in this sort of a thing whenever I see something like this coming up I'm like okay 
um, whoever needs to leave my life okay because there is going to be a judgment and it's going to be okay fine whoever leave, needs to leave my life but yeah you know bye I don't have a I you know I, I really you know the last couple of years since I've been on this part I've realized that you don't need to have a broken heart because whatever is leaving your life whatever that is moving out of your life it's for the right reason it's for the best reasons and the right reasons so bye bye <laughs> just wave bye because obviously you didn't need the, this sort of a situation in your life so you know it's 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 one of those cards where the energy is as if you know everything all is lost and everything but it's not it's really not whenever someone is leaving your life though the pain um, will be very um, it's it will be very hard and um, and this pain whatever it is it's okay it's okay because um, you know at the end of the day you know if the person if it was a true friend or whatever then it would be okay okay let's look the energy um, what you're having is that you be working with a lot of and 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 now I see um, the whole team of your month the whole team of your month basically is that um, there is going to be a transition a transition and for most of the people who um, at work there is going to be um, a transition at work there is going to be people who are going to be uh, you know having a new beginning in their lives and these are the people over 40 you're going to be having a new beginnings in life and um, some of you are going to be dealing with um, people who um, the energy of someone who is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and you can be dealing with this person in your personal life or in your work life because obviously um, there you are kind of connecting with a person to build something but at the same time you're standing up for yourself and you're saying you know this is what I want this is what I want and I don't want to be you know I don't want people to walk over me or that sort of a situation and then you are going to see these changes happening you have the energy of the son of one the son of ones is and um, the energy of uh, um, um, someone between the ages of 25 and 45 and this person you know um, whatever the situation that is going on with this person you need to have inner strength okay you really really need to have inner strength so whatever is going on with this person you really really need to have inner strength as we're looking going up it is a situation where um, um, this person whoever this person is he's the energy of the son of ones and whoever he is there's going to be information that is coming um, from him and then you have the energy of also um, another um, the daughter of ones another um, fire person so um, this is this is actually um, going to be a situation that is um, playing out here because what is happening is that you have all these um, Leo's, uh, Leo's Aries and Sagittarius person that you guys will be working with in this um, month because obviously there's a judgment and this judgment is going to come from them that these could be also your family member because I'm seeing the son of ones and the daughter of ones so um, a lot of you who are connected whether you're the parents because the mother is there and then the kids are here some of you um, ladies out there or gentlemen are going to have a situation with your kids especially the kids who are um, who, who are either Aries Leo or Sagittarius there is a situation that is happening here that is going to be affecting you and your kids and it has to do with balancing out emotions for some and some it has to do with balancing out your financial situation and make sure your kids are being um, taken care of as we look remember we have right in the middle we have in the center the energy of strength and this 
um, energy of strength is going to be the focal point of your um, of your uh, of the month of February for you um, Aquarians because whatever is transpiring you have the nine of one so it's as if because in the second week and the third week you have the energy of the nine of ones and the seven of cups and in this week what is happening is that a lot of protection is coming at you uh, you know just a whole lot of protection is coming at you and with the protection that is coming at you you have the energy of the seven of cups the energy of the Sun is in the reverse of the moon which is just very strange with these cards but that's why I so love them because there is so many information that is coming up and what is what is old in a lot of people is that you are focusing on protecting yourself at the same time but letting people know how far they can go with you and this is what is transpiring here is as if the energy of the tower that comes up in the first week as clear a situation with this um, person who could be your your mother who is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and you know it's as if you're working together with her but yet still you're saying look it's okay and move back home but whatever the situation is I will try and help out but this is where it goes I don't want you to go over these sort of a situation and then um, oh my god this is this is so good okay so for some people you are going to feel a loss for some people you or letting people know how far they can go with you and um, I think this is uh, um, very very good because people tend to want to just blow over other people and this is good for you Aquarians to say hey um, this is what I'll do I don't want you to um, really um, um, you know walk over my boundaries okay I haven't used these cards in a very long time and you guys have the energy of uh, nature energy with the angels of love um, conducting um, angels with Archangel and, and Saint Illyrian um, trainee guides and the fairies isn't this wonderful and um, for you guys it's your birthday month so it's wonderful because you have the energy of nature um, now nature energies with um, the angels of love conducting angels with um, uh, Saint Illyrian um, and trainees of guides and the fairies so this is wonderful and a lot of fairies are born on the knee under the sign of um, a lot of fairies are born under the sign of the Aquarians. A lot of you are fairies, okay? Um, I turned the card up. Oh my gosh, okay. So, 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 ladies and gentlemen, wow. So, let's use the unicorn. I love the unicorn, so let's see what is happening dignity okay old your head up I and know um, the unicorns are supporting you old your head up high and know that the unicorns are supporting you okay I love when the cards come up because it's given me a sense uh, and the the <laughs> one of the most strangest thing is that it's, it's, it's just a little thing because um, everybody thinks that people like us that we don't go through things but we go through a lot and not saying anything we do go through a lot and um, it's the strangest thing because I moved and um, so happened that my neighbor um, invited me for coffee and I went there and we started talking and he says oh my god I have to apologize to you so I said why you have to apologize to me and he says I have made um, the wrong assumption about you and I said oh, what are you talking about he goes um, I really thought you were just snobby and you just walk with your head up high <laughs> and I am so so wrong about you you're such a nice person you you know you're and it is it's kind of 
you know it's it's good when someone can really apologize for it you know thinking something and then realizing that you know this person is just totally someone and th that's what we do all the time we judge we tend to judge people and um, you know it's, it's, it's good because I really appreciate what he says because it was a very nice thing to say because sometimes people don't really tell you the truth what they think so this is wonderful um, you guys have realization and I guess he realized that you know um, he can be wrong um, a lot of people always kind of judge me see and think that I'm stuck up or something but I'm just one of those really normal people who I'm just um, but that was very funny and um, I have certain respect because he apologized and he said you know I, I really misjudged, misjudged you so that was um, really nice and wonderful so I guess realization comes up because a lot of you are going to re realize a lot of stuff that is going on around you with you and this is um, um, this is going to be extremely good and this is going to be wonderful so realization the frequency of realization supports um, the in internal process of becoming aware of our heart center truth as well as the external process of becoming our highest expression in this world isn't this wonderful it's a beautiful beautiful energies um, I want to say to you ladies and gentlemen um, you know whatever that transpire in this month it's it's just a realization of life is full of surprises okay and what I'm seeing there's a lot of stuff that is could be good be going to happen to you and the fire sign people and um, but there's another nice things and in this time you are protected this is one of the times that the Pentacles came up for you Aquarians but not so whatever is transpiring because you have the energy of judgment and it is really really a month of judgment for you Aquarians okay and realization so judgment and realization is coming up so this is good because you're going to see people and uh, and and realize a lot of stuff about people just like my neighbor did he thought I was I, I just walk with my nose up in the hair and really I just go but I you know it's good that he says that so I I really but you know I'm just so busy I'm just always on the go and I'm just so busy so he realized that actually I was someone different and uh, you know he apologized and you know if most of us in life do that really apologize when we find out you know that you know we misjudge someone for something and um, this people will be you know this will be a, a, a very nice uh, um, place um, on her to live because we can at least um, say that we have misjudged people because a lot of people tend to uh, not um, say um, that they've misjudged someone and this you know it was such a nice thing for him to really um, say you know I would never this was the first time I've ever misjudged someone so um, try not to um, try to hold your head up high and have dignity and the number eight energies is going to be um, your energy number eight is going to be your number energy for this month it's here three times you have um, the eight of Pentacles and the eight of Wands, and you have the infinity sign the number eight so you guys have the number eight sign three times um, I want to say to each and every person I'm wishing you a wonderful wonderful birthday that is coming up please remember to listen to your birthday readings because they will be coming out some is already out but for the people who were born in February um, this year is actually going to be um, you know a good year for you guys so not to worry about anything this is going to be good and positive okay so um, ladies and gentlemen whatever happened in your life remember 
to hold your head up high and to have dignity and to remember that whenever someone judge you they're judging them their own selves okay whenever someone judge you they're judging them their own selves namaste